Hello Internet, Review Dude here. Okay, quick little video today to compare these two Alcatel One Touches. I have had a few comments from people who are looking at buying this phone here in Australia. And I just want to quickly show you the main difference. So there's the one that I have reviewed before. Put the review down at the bottom. That's the 4G Pixie 4.5 from Optus. And here on the left you have the Alcatel One Touch Pixie 3 4.5. So they're very similar. And uh, that's from Telstra. Now, this one costs $29, and I've seen it on special for $19. And this one costs, well, cost me $69, and I've seen them on special for, I think, $49 or $59 here and there. So I had bought them a couple weeks ago now, and the prices have dropped a little bit. Okay, they are two worlds apart. So I did comment on the unboxing for the this one here, the Telstra one, that it feels similar in the hand, but um, when you look at them side by side like this, you can see that one is thicker, than the other, but they do look very similar. Okay, this one has a um, etched back, doesn't tell you who you're with. This one tells you it's, you're with Telstra, you can be really proud. Yeah, Telstra, yeah, premium phone, premium, well, premium service anyway, and um, it is a bit better. So, um, yeah, look, the big difference is I can't really show you um, because you're gonna kind of use it for a while to get the experience with it, but on startup, this phone stutters like you wouldn't believe, and some delays very similar to the uh, zte chat that i have done a review for i'll put that down the bottom as well um, this one uh you know what i think of this phone if you've seen my other review it's a um pretty good product so just to quickly show you the names the models this here is called the 5017 5017a and this one is where are we over here you can see there's a bit of a delay as you're going about playing with the phone. Um, where's the model number? Model number. There it is, 4027A. Okay, so it tells me it's, it's an older generation phone and only 3G. Uh, yeah, apart from that, you know, they're both usable. Obviously, they're, um, you know, for, for the price, this is an absolute bargain. This one is now, I would call a sub, something a bit substandard, on par with like a... Mm, probably a really high performing G27, a uh, HT, um, HTC G27, which is like an ages old phone now. Um, so, yeah, you can, you know, it does what you want. You can play Minecraft on it. Um, but, yeah, I, I definitely can't say I would recommend this phone unless it's for a, you know, giving it to someone um, for a backup or something like that. Um, so, there you go. That, that's that's the main difference between these two phones, and that's why you can buy this one for $19 and this one for $59. Um, yeah, if you have any questions, please ask in the comments below. Please subscribe. I've got lots of these videos. I'm going to do more samples, give you a sample of um, how, how this does video soon. And, um, yeah, that's about it, everybody. Good luck. Bye.